right, this myth comes from the 70s. Apparently rock bands would go to hotels and pull these pranks. And one of the pranks was they would glue the furniture from the room on the ceiling. Okay, the crazy part of this to me is not just the logistics, but the time restraint. They would have had to do it like overnight. We should not only glue our furniture up, but we should do it within a day. All right, let's get to it. All right, now we've built ourselves a room. We're gonna stage it just like a hotel. And then the fun begins. We're actually going to glue everything to the ceiling so that we can make an upside down room. I'm curious to see if this is actually gonna work. So this is the room that we are gonna turn upside down. Now it's built to code and it has everything you would find in a hotel room. We have a desk with a computer on it. We got a light stand. We got a bed with sheets. That ain't gonna be easy. We have a coffee table with a whole bunch of stuff on that. We have a couch. There's a plant. There's a television. Maybe some dirty laundry. I mean, this is one of our rooms. <laughs> <laughs> Although none of these items weighs as much as a car, what's critical is the materials they're made from. These lumpy, absorbent surfaces are a super adhesive's kryptonite. It would be difficult to get them to stick to the floor, let alone the ceiling, and we don't have that much time. But my guess, the most difficult thing to get to stick to the ceiling, the bed. With the checkout clock ticking, Tori needs to first stick the bed not to the ceiling, but to itself. So what I'm trying to do is get as much glue on the mattress as possible. But even then, I don't know how well it's going to stick. Seven drops was enough to lift a car, but it's taken seven bottles to stick the mattress to the base. But eventually, it's set for liftoff. All right, so this tool is normally used to lift sheetrock up to the ceiling. But we're going to be using it to lift furniture so we can glue it to the ceiling. I bet it was never intended for that. It's a delicate balance. Uh, there's something you don't see every day. Between letting the glue harden. I never glued a bed to the roof before. And staying on top of the clock. Ah, this is stinky. Get it wrong. All right, let's see if the glue holds the bed up. And this myth will come crashing down to earth. Looks pretty solid so far. Freaking, hey, hey. That is awesome. It's holding. That is one upside down bed with a cherry on top. Sweet. 